A vibrant array of coconut and cassava-based products took center stage at the Ministry of Agriculture's Coconut and Cassava Festival, drawing participants and enthusiasts from all corners of St. Lucia. The festival showcased the creativity and dedication of local farmers and entrepreneurs, offering a glimpse into the diverse uses of these locally grown products. Among the showcased items at the festival were coconut seamoss icicles, fresh coconuts, cassava and coconut pastries, and coconut liquor, exemplifying the potential of these natural resources. Parliamentary representative for Miku North, Jeremiah Norbert, expressed his enthusiasm for the festival, stating that the event not only catered to the culinary senses, but also served as an educational platform, enlightening attendees on the many roles coconut and cassava play in the island's culture and economy. I'm happy that Miku was chosen to host this cassava and coconut festival. Um, I'm happy to see the amount of people here today. And it, this thing has a spill-off effect, not just for those persons um, involved or from the ministry standpoint, from, but for the constituents. Today, Sunday, um, they take it as a family day, but you also get the educational component where they can come out, find out what the coconut and cassava can be used for, while they get to enjoy the time with their family. And to see so many byproducts of coconut and cassava here today is very impressive, and I know that this will go a long way. Um, and I want to applaud the Ministry of Agriculture for choosing Miku to host this activity. I want to also thank the um, Taiwanese Technical Mission and the Embassy of, Thai of China, Taiwan, for um, funding this this entire activity because I think without them we would not be able to have that and, and, and we really appreciate that we can have such an activity. Minister for Agriculture, Fisheries, Food Security and Rural Development, Honorable Alfred Prosper, underlined the critical role of events like the Coconut and Cassava Festival in promoting local consumption and production to ensure the food and nutrition security of St. Lucia. There is always an opportunity for a number of new products coming on display from what we locally produce. But my concern is, I do not want to see those products only when we have a festival. Because I want to see them on the supermarket shelves, in the small shops, in the local, in the communities where our kids That's why and other persons can here. access them. For free as well. Now I know they have challenges with food safety yeah, and right. standards and labeling and packaging. We had a meeting with the agro-processors a few days ago and they raised all, all those challenges. But I see tremendous potential in this agro-processing subsector that St. Lucia can tap into and create that in opportunity for more of our persons to generate an income from that subsector. As the Ministry of Agriculture continues its steadfast commitment to promoting awareness of local products and fostering entrepreneurial innovation, Minister Prosper has affirmed that further initiatives are underway to fortify economic growth, reinforce food security, and enhance the livelihoods of all citizens in St. Lucia. From the Communications Unit of the Ministry of Agriculture, I am Anicia Antoine reporting.